Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 Kaiserreich as the United Kingdom. Let us try to make France capitulate this episode. I mean, we're attacking the entirety of the North Front. It's not going that well, all things considered. Like, we are losing hundreds of thousands of men, but it, it could be going significantly worse. Down here in Spain, things are going fantastic. Uh, we just landed our troops into Barcelona. And that is basically creating another front line with the, the French. Which is something that we do love to see. Uh, Ukraine's not been called into the war. I mean, Ukraine doesn't matter. Yeah, you guys just hold position for right now. These guys can continue to attack. That should be fine. If we cut the, I mean, I was going to say these, this might cut guys off from supplies, but I don't think that's true. If we do that, we'll cut these guys out from supplies. That's, uh, I think more or less guaranteed. So things are going well. We got some reinforcements from the French, uh, which is excellent. I mean, I would like to get an encirclement bonus on them at some point. I'd also like to try to do, like, who's in too long? Two divisions. That's really not that much. If we just like try to take over all these coastal cities that they probably don't have defended, that might be enough to get the capitulation anyways, without having to take over. So you're worth three, you're worth three, and your niece is worth ten. Okay, so we got one thing there. We'll get another one ready to go into that city, and then we'll get another one to go into Nice. Back, Keep on attacking these guys. One of you I'm going to set uh, ready to go for naval invasion. Will we beat the French there? Uh, the answer to the question is no, but he's pretty on pretty low organization right now. 24%. And I think that was only worth one victory point. So these three might be enough to do it for us. Maybe. It might be enough. You know what? I'm actually going to send these two guys over uh, onto these naval invasion plans for right now. Should um like you're trying to move your way down to the south. Do you have enough guys to really cover the entire front here? But it would still be nice to deal with the other guys. So these will be ready at some point. I mean, do we have a uh, superiority over here? Yes, we do. 83%. Can I just say it's really nice to have nail superiority? Um, just all the time. Compared to never knowing if you actually have it or not. And having to try to get it from the AI. And it's always like a huge hassle. You know, you guys can help the Germans out. Even though, again, Germany basically did nothing. They were just a meat grinder. More than they lost some, they somehow lost a million men. How did he do that when you were not actually doing much? Like, like, they lost more men than I have, and I've actually been doing shit. Get these guys going. We got um, some heart attack and piercing up, which is fantastic. Again, that's actually like a year and a head ahead of time. We love to see 80 days for a 1941 artillery tech. Of course, I would also like to have that in my arsenal. Ready. 
See if we can keep on dealing with some situations here. Uh, green line, I'm gonna have you spread out to here. Delete this. All of you are here now. So you don't need to be down there, I think. Are we not gonna take any city? Like, I don't even know if that horse is actually supposed to be there or not. I think it just was... just It was just there one day. Um... I mean, like, getting the next level of rifle would also be very nice, but 108 days for uh, the next level of tactics would be nice. Okay. So we can either get uh, population goes up, stability goes up, political power gain. It makes the social liberal and social democracy go up. No syndicalist welfare in New Britain. Let's support the conservative bill. I think that's fine. We took over one city. Is that enough for the capitulation? No, we got him down one more percentage. Oh, they didn't have any troops in Nice? Uh, pardon? You know Nice is like a very important city. There we go. The capitulation of France is at hand. And did the whole faction capitulate? Uh, they did. We're going to pass a million times. I don't even want to give Germany anything because they suck. I'll give them Ukraine because there's really nothing I can do about it. So. French Republic. Take all of France. It's all of yours. I am going to take Spain. Because I'm the faction leader. I think it makes sense. Germany. My kind of really shitty ally. You can have Ukraine. Wait. Italy and um, you basically weren't involved in anything. So you know what? I am going to take Italy. And I'll let Germany have the commune. I think that's basically as good as we're going to get under the circumstances. So now we're kind of in a situation where we're like, what do we want to do? Apparently did not set a national focus because I'm bad. Uh, improve British Rail, thank you. You're still at war with Germany. Germany's also still at war with Japan. Like, J Germany's in some issues, to say the least. You're all the Marine Divisions, okay. So the guys who are not Marine Divisions, uh, please lead the Marine Divisions. Yeah, so all of you are here. Hoping there's no other battle plans, at least on the map. I'm sure there is somewhere. Which would be a little bit annoying. Have you guys prepare for there. Uh, I'm going to quickly give it a few days just so it'll... Uh, return Sardinian lands. Do they have claims on all this territory? They have a little bit. Only Genoa, though, apparently. Carlist, Kingdom of Spain, Spanish Republic, partition the Spanish mainland. I was, oh yeah, I was going to give something to Portugal, but I never did. I don't want to partition Spain. Also, we're not Catholic, we are Protestant. Let's go for the Kingdom of Spain. I'm actually I'm gonna just quickly uh, give this state to Portugal. So, what else needs to be done? Give it to our Sardinian allies. Okay, so there you go. You have a little bit of territory. It looks a little bit strange, but what can you do? So the Marine Divisions, your new job is essentially going to be. From here uh, to, like, Hamburg. A very North German invasion. I'm just waiting for them to release Switzerland so it'll actually uh, 
not screw up my, my battle plan here, but I don't think it's going to be happening right now, so we'll uh, worry about it later. You guys are going to be ready for here. And you guys, my good friends. Uh, that's a great question. Also, I don't know what's going to happen with here, so mark state, mark state. It won't actually let me release this as anything, so... I was transferred to you. So all of you guys, you are going to push your way up to the Rhine River. You guys are going to push your way through Switzerland. Again, I don't know what I'm going to do with you yet. Yeah, that battle plan, I think, is all working fine. For now, you know what? You go here. And you're going to, like, spearhead straight to the river. And I think that's looking pretty okay, I think, for now. My question is... How am I going to attack the Germans? Or when, also, would be, would be a good question. So let's get a research bonus. Get our troops to the border. So the Entente is looking pretty, pretty strong, I would say so myself. I mean, the Reichsback's also looking pretty strong as well. But of course, they're at war. I don't know if the Russian Republic's going... I mean, okay, they're still war with this guy, so they're going to deal with that first. But if a Russian-German war breaks out, I think that might be our time to strike. But of course, there's actually nothing I can do. I can just fight a war against them. It's going to take 35 days. Or I try to rule the waves. Also, Gibraltar uh, should be mine. I should have... I, I can't do it like separately, unfortunately. But Gibraltar is rightful British clay. No question about that. So apparently, uh... Wait, why do people say get territory? I don't know. Get rid of all this nonsense, because it doesn't matter anymore. So we're still missing carrier fighters. I literally don't care at all. And I'm not giving Spain back Gibraltar. I mean, I have an option here for, uh... Treaty of Gibraltar. You know, fine. We'll give it, to, we'll give it back to them. And we'll just use a Treaty of Gibraltar to fix that situation. So we'll go back up to speed 5, at least for now. So yeah, the uh, I'm actually surprised we went not really well. Yeah, so now we got our own little tiny Switzerland. In the Reich's Pact, and it involves in many, many wars. I can't really support the Egyptians right now. I can ask them to join the Entente. Uh, it was a Treaty of Egypt. Assuming they'll say yes to it. Which they might not. Five Eyes Agreement, the Indian Act. Which none of these we can actually do. Unfortunately. So the Empire Act is something that's like very late game. Like it's so late game that... India has to be un like unified. I'm still trying to fight Nepal. I hate this so much. Why... Do you do this to me? 211,000 men dead. Trying to take Nepal. Does that seem like a good uh, a good trade for you? I don't think so. But apparently they're proclaiming... Like, you can complain the King of India. Or, uh, King of Italy, I should say. Probably would be a little bit nicer for you, but sure. You don't want to do that. I can't make you. Much as I wish I could. So, it's May 1940... Let's get some, some more technology, making our industry a little bit better. Like Germany, you know, you got Switzerland and Ukraine. That's more than honestly you probably deserved. I mean, I actually I don't know how strong they were doing in Ukraine. I didn't really get a good eye on that. But yeah, we're really going to have to uh, rule the wave. Thirty-five days, Tree of Egypt. I could try to just get them into my faction. That would get us that war. I'm guessing it's just Canada. The French Republic is trying to assume leadership. No, I don't... Again, you're not even allowed to do that in... This game. Or in the mod, I should say. I mean, you guys should return to Paris, by the way. I don't know if you, uh... 
First spend an uh man French Caribbean. There you go. Now you're gonna return to Paris in one week's time. Good on you. So national focus. Let's go for rule the waves. Doesn't really do much for us right now, but Okay, no, it does, it does, uh, this is a little bit slow. Nothing I can really do about that, I guess. So Ireland is still in the right spec. I would like them to be in the Entente. I don't know if Germany would say yes to that agreement or not, though. Like, does Germany even have other borders defended with us? They... Not really. They have, like, a handful of troops, but not that much. One total artillery. Thank you, Spain. You're really pulling your weight around here, I would say. Like, I'm just... There we go. How did that happen? I don't know. I just think it's a dumb war. And it, it's... Like, who cares? Okay, so they're going to reclaim Sardinia Piedmont. Like, you could have been the king of Italy. My good friend. Pass it a million times and just give it to India. Finally. The situation resolved itself. Was it worth it? Uh, no, not even slightly. We're not at war anymore. I don't know if that does anything for us, but it might do some things for our allies. They might have some, uh... Focuses they can't really do otherwise. You're in Rice Pack, you're in the on top. I mean, you're already in this, so you don't have to really worry about it too much. You can claim the Bourbon Throne? That's wild. Okay, so the French are back in Paris. Good on them. Will they uh, have another election, or are they going to... I mean, they're, they're market liberal. Apparently, everybody in the world is market liberal. I don't really know why. Just everybody's like, yeah, you know what? Let's all be market liberal today. Like, we're market liberal. Canada is market... Oh, no, you're a social conservative. We've gone uh, a different route. We got 35 days. I mean, Ireland... It would be nice to get them involved back in. Like, Ireland, don't you want to be best friends with your good friend UK? We've had so much fun in the past. I think you should just... Uh, agree to be my friend. I mean, an attack against Germany right now... Would probably go pretty okay. Maybe. I mean, we don't have that many men. The CSA still has not defeated the Pacific States quite yet. They are going to get there eventually. And if I get in, if I get Egypt into my faction, I'm guessing that might just disband the the Cairo Pact. So the Irish policy, Ireland, please come back to me. I would love to have you. Also, it's, can I just say it's very strange just to see it read France. It's just a bit odd. It's, it's, it's strange. Like, unnatural. Are these considered core provinces? They're still colony states. Except for, like, North Algeria, which makes sense. Um, technologies. Uh, let's go for 1940. Let's go for some encryption. Probably wouldn't hurt. We'll get our Irish policy done very, very soon. But for now, I think this is going to be a good time to end this episode. So thanks for watching. My name is Anthem. If you've enjoyed, remember to thumbs up. If you're not enjoying it, tell you something down. You want to see me subscribe and goodbye.